Welcome to the Rich Club channel. Please watch the video to the end and if you like it, support the channel with a like and subscribe. Let's go. In this video, you will learn why XRP will rise to $1000. So before the video starts, write in the comments how much the XRP token will cost in a month. To the one who guesses, we will transfer 1000 tokens. You also need to like and subscribe. Press the bell so you don't miss your profit in it again. Over the last two weeks, XRP price has formed an ascending channel formation. Within the past day, price has fallen below this channel, breaking the bottom uptrend line. This is a short-term bearish scenario as price has already fallen near 5%. At the time of writing, XRP is sitting on its minor support of $0.707. Blockchain data recently shared by the Whale Alert platform, which tracks large movements of cryptocurrencies, shows that in the past 15 hours, an astounding lump of 250 million XRP tokens has been transferred to the Bitstamp exchange. Meanwhile, Ripple continues sending XRP to the HUOB trading platform to support the coin's liquidity. 250 million XRP on the move. Over the past 15 hours, the Whale Alert team has spotted a 250 million XRP stash sent to the Bitstamp crypto trading venue with its headquarters in Luxembourg. The transaction was made by an anonymous sender. However, the details provided by XRP analytics service Bitham showed that the massive amount of crypto was transferred by the Uphold Exchange. Ripple keeps sending millions of XRP to Huobi. As part of providing its customers and partners, including crypto exchanges, with XRP, Ripple blockchain technology provider continues sending crypto to the Huobi exchange based in China. Previously, Utoday has covered Ripple conducting regular daily XRP transactions to Huobi, varying from over 7 million XRP to 1.4 million XRP. Brad Garlinghouse, CEO of Ripple, has been granted to seek data on XRP transactions from Binance. Core Grant's motion to obtain XRP documents The CEO of Ripple has been approved access to Binance documents of XRP transactions. Sarah Netburn, the presiding judge in Ripple's ongoing lawsuit with the Securities and Exchange Commission, has granted Brad Garlinghouse's motion to obtain documents from Binance. Garlinghouse is one of the defendants in the lawsuit filed by the SEC for an alleged violation of the Securities Act of 1933. Last week, the legal team representing Garlinghouse filed a motion requesting data on XRP sales from Binance, the largest cryptocurrency exchange by trading volume. The motion of request was made as part of the foreign discovery process by Ripple to gather data on all XRP sales made on the exchange. The motion was recently approved, which is not surprising as the SEC did not object to it. The approval has been considered a small win for Ripple in the legal case. The court will now issue a letter of request to the Cayman Islands-based exchange on behalf of Garlinghouse. If Binance heeds to the request, it will provide documents that may be used as evidence in the case. In the lawsuit filed in December 2020, the SEC alleged that Ripple and its executives, CEO Brad Garlinghouse and Executive Chairman Chris Larson, sold unregistered securities profited $1.3 billion in unregistered security sales over the span of eight years. The allegation has been refuted by Ripple's legal team. They also recently cited the lack of clarity defense and said that the SEC did not make its securities regulations clear. Now, they have planned another defense. By showing XRP sales that occurred outside the US, the Ripple team plans to show that the SEC may not have jurisdiction over such sales. In that regard, Binance is an important source of data on XRP sales. Previously, Ripple was allowed to seek similar data from other exchanges where XRP sales were made. XRP price has revived fairly well off its low set in late July. Prices have risen nearly 50% over the past two weeks, as XRP struggles to break its major resistance zone of 77 cents. Ripple has been battling the SEC over the last eight months over a lawsuit regarding XRP being sold as a security or not. Despite this, XRP is still trading within the market's averages, as other coins have had a lesser revival. The overall market is flashing signs that some type of bull trend is here after months of downtrending. How much will XRP cost at the end of 2021? Write your opinion in the comments, and do not forget about the likes.